The Illinois men's gymnastics team is coming off the Big Ten Championship. The team was honored on the field during the football game against Penn State last week. Anise McEwen introduces us to one member of the team who's proving doubters wrong. Clay Stevens doesn't see himself as different. That's worked pretty pretty well for me because then people treat me normally as well. The sophomore Illini gymnast was born without a right pectoral muscle. Everyone has their physical sort of strengths and weaknesses. I guess that mine's just uh, like you can, it's visual. When he got here, saw him finally close up first, you know, as gymnasts do, or walks in with his shirt off, and I'm like, oh yeah, he's missing a pack. I totally, like I totally forgot. That's probably because the Australian native doesn't want to focus on it. After all, he proved doctors wrong just by becoming a college athlete. I was told when I was very young that um, it would be hard for me to do upper body sports like tennis, swimming, and Ash Ashley mentioned gymnastics, but um, I guess my parents didn't hold anything against me. Illinois head coach Justin Spring didn't either. After fellow Aussie Tyson Bull joined the Illini in 2015, Spring and his staff took special interest in Stevens. He's without question one of the most focused hard-working gymnast in our gym right out the gate. And his teammates have taken notice, too, electing him as a team captain before his first meet as an Illini. To come in and earn a captainship nomination and be awarded the captainship on our team for six months being here while injured, not even competing, I think speak to his character above and beyond. Painting a lot will help me with my nerves and will help me sort of work out a best strategy for how I can compete the best. And he's spending this offseason working out to try and help the Illini get their second straight Big Ten title and their first national one since 2012. Reporting for your Illini Nation, Anise McEwen, WCIA 3 Sports.